Hello art students, this is Mrs. Brand here. Today I'm going to show you how to prepare a screen for screen printing your logo or another design from a vinyl cut. And the first thing we're going to do is take this vinyl cut and peel out the parts that will eventually have ink pushed through them for our screen print. We have a toolkit that consists of several tools that we will use for pulling apart the vinyl cut to attach to our screen. It's really hard to see because my vinyl is black, but as soon as I start picking out the um, parts that will allow ink to go through, you'll be able to see the design clearly. So, the first thing I'm going to do is find one piece that's ready to be removed. And I'm going to use this pointy tool to carefully pull up that piece of vinyl. You should do this carefully in case the vinyl cutter did not um, cut through all the way so that you're not removing pieces that you actually want to keep. Um, this part right here is starting to be removed. I actually want to leave it down, so I'm going to use my tool, hold down the inside shape, and I'll peel the outer outline. Almost finished. So this is my logo. Okay. So here I have my logo discard all the extra vinyl pieces that we don't need. The next step is to take this vinyl stencil and attach it to my screen. And I'm going to use this piece of plastic to help me adhere it. I'm going to use contact paper as a transfer paper. So the first thing I'm going to do is peel the backing from the contact paper. And then I'm going to place the contact paper on top of my design. And then this is where the plastic piece becomes very handy because I can smooth the design down. Now I'm going to take my screen Now I'm going to find the center of my screen and I'm going to place my vinyl on there. I'll use my plastic tool again to press the vinyl down. And just pay attention to your design and make sure that no pieces are still attached to the contact paper. Now a screen is made up of a really fine mesh and this mesh is what allows the ink to be evenly distributed onto your paper or garment. And I don't want any ink to go through this outer part. So what I can do is use plastic transparency to cover up all this outside part. Okay, and now I have my screen blocked off and my logo is ready for screen printing. Thank you.